Well, records are meant to be broken, and now one local couple is trying to make it into the record books. Haiti Clotter shows us how they are hoping to write themselves into history. When Roy and Cynthia Booth aren't operating Roy's Comics and Games in Bemidji, they are attempting to break records. The couple has an opportunity to be a part of the Guinness World Record books by surpassing the current record of more than 50 existing contributing writers in an anthology of short stories. I took a, a chapter from a novel I've been working on and just converted that into a short story. Uh, it's, a, it's a YA novel, fantasy novel, about a uh, young man who is a third generation privateer. A writer from South Africa challenged a current record holder saying he could have 100 writers participate in the series and publish a book. They wanted um, certain people to turn stories in within a certain period of time. And since we worked together, on the other side of things, he, he thought I would be a perfect fit for it. Roy says some of his writing comes from his nightmares. He uses a dark fiction part of it to create stories. For Cynthia, writing dark fiction and poetry is usually her style, but she wanted to do something different this time. That's great. That's a part of history, which, which makes it absolutely incredible um, and unique. Roy says this is a big deal to him because it's something that can go in his obituary. This achievement can also give Bemidji bragging rights. We always have to explain to people where is Bemidji. They've never heard of it. So it's, it, it kind of does put this area on the map in a way. The Booths have worked on several projects together, but this is one special project they can enjoy as individuals. Usually it's, 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 it's Roy and Cynthia or Cynthia and Roy, but now we're, we're separate authors on this one, and I really get a kick out of that. Yeah, that was nice. The collection of stories titled CEA Greatest Anthology Written is available to pre-order now. In Bemidji, Haiti Clotter, Lakeland News. The record of more than 100 stories will be verified after 1,000 paperback copies are printed and sold. Roy's piece took him about six hours to complete, and he's written 130 books and 50 under a pseudonym. Oh, wow. <laughs> pretty, pretty impressive. <laughs> If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.